This Korean chicken soup is a warm, high-protein dish that'll get you addicted to each spoon. It's so easy to make and great for meal prep for any time of the day. I'll leave the macros for this dish towards the end, so make sure to watch the whole video. Alright, let me show you my recipe. Chop up 20 grams of Chinese cabbage, or bok choy. Cut up half a medium-sized carrot into bite-sized pieces. Also cut up a green onion into bite-sized pieces. Also do the same with one small onion. Prepare about 50 grams of potatoes and cut them however you like them. Cutting them relatively smaller takes less time to cook them through. Pour about 1.5 liters of water into a pot along with the potatoes and the onions and start boiling the water. In the meantime, let's cook two chicken thighs on a frying pan over medium heat. They don't need to be fully cooked, just slightly for 5 minutes is good enough. Once the skin is slightly cooked and brown, take them out and remove the skin. The chicken skin mostly contains fat with little amount of protein, so it's better if you remove them. Once you're done removing the skin, add them into the pot. Also add 2 spoons of chicken stock and give it a nice mix and let it cook. Let's make the paste we'll use for the soup base. We need 2 spoons of fine pepper flakes, half spoon of salt, 2 dashes of pepper, 1 spoon of sesame oil, 1 half spoon of honey, 1 spoon of dark soy sauce, and finally, 1 spoon of finely chopped ginger. Mix all of it well for a minute, and it should look something like this. Add the paste into the soup. Also add the green onions and the pak choy. When the pak choy becomes soft under boiling water, your soup is finished and ready to be served. This soup comes with a total of 499 calories, 45 grams of protein, 16 grams of carbs, and 27 grams of fat. Try it at home today. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe.